Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tiffany and today's video I'm going to be testing out a little concealer hack tip trick you know it's supposed to be like an instant facelift you know for your girl i saw this originally on monica style music's channel on like her last video i think it was like an updated like glam roots i don't remember what the actual video was called but it's a video she just put up or whatever if i remember i'll put it down in the description box so you guys can see what the hell i'm talking about um she might have seen it on tiktok or something but i'm not really sure i don't know i didn't ask her she doesn't know me i mean but call me gray hey um but yeah, I wanted to test it out. Her face is more narrow, and most people that I have seen try it out, other than her, have had more narrow faces. So I wanted to see how it looked on a girl who had a round, full, you know, voluptuous, the cheeks, honey, because she got... She got Miss Pac-Man head, okay? My face is my face and my head is shaped like Miss Pac-Man, so she's a little round. And some stuff that be working on the girls who already have, like longer not longer but like slimmer more narrow face doesn't always translate on the girls to got a little bit something extra up here so i wanted to come on here and represent for us to see how it went for us and honestly i kind of like it so if you guys are interested in seeing me try the little hack and me just get this look in general then make sure you stay tuned to the video before we jump in though if you're not already subscribed make sure you do that and if you didn't already give this video a thumbs up but yeah without further ado let's just jump right in as you guys can see my eyes are already done we're not doing eyes on video today i'm a little ashy though she's a little ashy look let me put some serum on my hands or something i don't have any lotion next to my person right now so I'm just going to take a little bit of the serum I have on my table. Look a little better. Look a little better. Yeah, you look a little better. We're good. Okay, so like I was saying, as you guys can see, my eyes are done. And I am obsessed with how my eyes look right now. Okay, I'm obsessed. She got a wig on today. She got some hair pins in today. Who am I? Okay, so let me just jump right into the face. Boom. So I'm going to be taking this Milk Hydro Grip primer. Okay. Y'all already know. Bay. My focus on my camera is really acting shady right now. Okay. So I'm going to go into concealer first. And I'm going to be taking the Dose of Colors. What is it called? Meet Your Hue Concealer in 24 Dark. Hopefully that thumbnail sticks because that would be cute, cute. Okay, so I just went off camera and took a picture of this. Look at my thumbnail because I just feel like this is this is cool. And I am letting this sit. So I'm going to be using my matchstick in Espresso from Fenty. I wasn't about to tell y'all where the matchstick was from because I feel like y'all already know. But if y'all don't already know and this is your first time seeing me, hey. Um, but yeah, from Fenty. And I'm going to boom, boom, just right there, and get up here. Around my forehead or whatever. So I'm going to blend my concealer out first, and then I'm going to jump into blending out my contour. So I'm going to do my nose first. take a brush where is the brush to so blend out my contour but I have to locate the brush first and I don't know where it is 
Okay, so I'm going to blend out my nose contour with this Real Techniques crease brush. And I am blending this up into my brow. Oh, I think I'm going to add a little bit more contour on my nose and blend that out. So let me just go ahead and do that now. Okay, so I'm going to blend out the rest of my contour with this Morphe foundation brush. And I'm going to change my camera battery because it's dying. And when I come back, this will be blended out. Okay. I did go ahead and just blend out my contour with this Morphe brush. Like I said, it looks like I already have like my face done, but I don't. Okay. You already know this foundation the top is super messy <sighs> whatever I'm just gonna go with it we're gonna go with it and i'm going to take about a pump and a half because from being honest it kind of blends out well normally i use a sponge if i'm being honest to actually apply my foundation but i've been using the brush lately so I really, now, all right, now I'm thinking about it. I didn't need this much foundation, but here we are. I want to brighten up under here. I don't need to brighten up, but I do want to brighten up a little bit. So I'm going to take my Born This Way Concealer in Butterscotch. I'm just going to put a little bit right here. I'm even going to swipe it on the side of the bottle. Just put a little bit. Because I do want a little bit more brightness. Just a tad, okay? I'm going to blend this out and I'm going to keep it right here. And I'm going to set this with my Laura Mercier powder. I'm going to go back over the bottom with my foundation brush. I lied. My Laura Mercier powder is not in my vicinity. I'm not getting up to get it. I'm going to use my Fenty powder and cashew instead. This is not cashew. This is nutmeg. Okay. I'm literally dropping everything. Okay, let me just make sure all this is blended before I even put any powder down here. Tap. Fenty powder is strong. That looks so good though. I'm gonna take a little skinny brush and put some powder down the bridge of my nose. All right. Now I wanna take my nutmeg powder that rolled away, all the way under my table, and set the rest of my base. wipe the powder up my hand because what is what is that even okay i'm going to take this morphe what is this called glamour bronze and leader leader i don't like how i just said that and i'm going to take this morphe brush i'm 
being very generous with the bronzer. I want the bronzer to kind of like be that chick. I want her to stand out. My forehead looks like I didn't put any highlighter or anything up there. So I'm going to put some of the cashew powder up there just to like, I feel like even things out because it just looks very, not a part of the rest of the look, very on its own, very pushed to the side. Do I want, I didn't put any bronzer on my nose. And actually, I think I might just leave that where it is and just, you know, not bother too much. I'm just going to go into blush. I'm going to take my Bella blush on this angled Morphe brush. You already know I use this. Well, I don't use this every time I do my blush, but it is my favorite blush brush. I'm going to dust off this powder on my nose okay let me press that in because <laughs> that was a lot and it was just sitting there okay what do I need now what do I need now <laughs> my lower lash line girl get your life together Okay, so now I remember it. I need to do my lower lash line. Pretty sure I said that already, but I don't remember that. So I'm going to take some black liner and just pop that down there. And I'm going to dip into the palette that I used and just take this. Brown shade right there. Difference putting shadow on your lower lash line makes is impeccable. It's remarkable. It's show stopping. It is Okay, so let me put this down. I have a lot of crap on my table right now. So I'm, I keep looking around because I don't know where anything is. Everything is just out of whack and it's a mess. I am a mess. Okay, so I'm going to take, where is it? This brown liner. Don't know if it's a lip, it's my pencil, but it's brown, it's dark brown and it's what I need today. If I'm doing look like this and I'm leaving out the house, I'm gonna leave a I'm gonna have a matte lip because gloss and these masks don't go together at all. So I would normally leave it matte. But since I'm not going anywhere, I'm gonna do a gloss today. Put some Vaseline on first because I'm doing a lipstick and the lipstick is matte and I don't want it to tug on my lips. I'm gonna be using Cool Brown from Anastasia. The lipstick is literally in here, it broke. So, <laughs> I'm just gonna use what's right here. Yeah, that worked out. And I'm gonna take my Morphe Gloss in Freebird. This looks so a good. I didn't put on any highlighter. And I really don't think I want to. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead, hop off camera, do something to my hair, change this little shirt, and I'll be back. Okay, so this is the finish of look. And honestly, all I did was put like four big wand curls in my hair and then brush them out. I didn't spray my hair or anything. I just wanted to look like something instead of just flat because I had like put mousse in it all. It was a whole thing, okay? It was a whole thing. But I love how this turned out. And I'm pretty proud of myself about the eyeliner. I didn't do the eyeliner on camera, but look at the material. Look at the freaking material, okay? Um, but that is all I have for this video today. So like I always tell you guys, I'm your Tiffany. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.